welcome back to Foresight TV with me, Esma. The newly formed interim government in Bangladesh has issued a directive concerning the Durga Puja celebrations, urging the Hindu community to pause certain activities during the Azan and Namaz. This directive announced by Home Affairs Advisor Lieutenant General Retired Mohammad Jahangir Alam Chaudhary is aimed at maintaining religious harmony during the country's largest Hindu festival. The interim government's move comes as a part of broader measures to ensure security and manage the law and order situation during the festival, which sees the establishment of thousands of puja mandabs across the nation. Here's a special story from Foresight TV. <laughs> The interim government has requested puja committees to halt the use of musical instruments and sound systems during the Azan and Namaz. Lieutenant General Jahangir Alam Chaudhary stated that these activities should cease five minutes before the Azan to avoid any disturbances during prayer times. The directive is intended to promote peaceful coexistence and respect for religious practices for both Hindu and Muslim communities in Bangladesh. Puja committees have reportedly agreed to comply with these guidelines. The measure reflects the government's effort to manage religious festivities in a way that respects the practices of different communities and maintains public order. The directive is particularly focused on avoiding conflicts that may arise from overlapping religious observances, thereby ensuring a harmonious atmosphere during the festival. This year, Bangladesh will see a significant number of Durga Puja mandaps with a total number of 32,666 planned across the country. Specifically, Dhaka South City will host 157 mandaps, while 88 will be set up in the North City Corporation. This represents a slight decrease from last year's 33,431 mandaps. Despite the decrease, this year's festival preparations are extensive, highlighting the scale of the celebrations. To ensure the safety and smooth conduct of the festivities, the government has assured comprehensive security measures. Lieutenant General Chaudhary emphasized that security will be in place from the idol-making stage through the entire festival period. Authorities are committed to providing round-the-clock protection at the puja mandaps to prevent any disruptions or illegal activities. This proactive approach is designed to safeguard the festival's celebratory spirit and, and prevent any untoward incidents. In a broader context, the interim government's chief advisor, Mohammed Yunus, has emphasized the importance of communal harmony in Bangladesh. In his address to the nation, Yunus called for unity and warned against actions that could disrupt religious peace. He stressed that any individual who attempts to undermine societal harmony or engage in unlawful behavior will face legal consequences. This call underscores the interim government's commitment to fostering a peaceful and inclusive environment during the festival and beyond. The interim government's directives and assurances regarding Durga Puja reflect a concerted effort to maintaining religious harmony and ensure public safety during one of Bangladesh's most significant festivals. By urging the Hindu community to pause certain activities during prayer times and implementing robust security measures, the government aims to facilitate a peaceful and respectful celebration of Durga Puja. Concurrently, the emphasis on communal harmony and legal enforcement highlights a broader commitment to societal stability and the prevention of conflicts. As the festival approaches, these measures are expected to contribute to a harmonious and secure environment for all communities involved. That's all for today. Thanks for watching Foresight TV with me, Isma.